Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Genshin Impact Hangout Events. In the last episode, we started Chongyun's Hangout Events, and in this episode, we'll be getting another ending in Chongyun's. Um, obviously, because we started it last time. Um, and we're gonna continue with it. Um, let's see. We got... Where is Chongyun? Um, we got this one last week. Uh, this is probably going to be a relatively short episode. Because we're going to go back here and get that other branch that's uh, in this one. So let's continue from here. And we're going to go up to Wulong Hill. Okay. go talk to Chong Yun and I'm assuming to get this other branch we just have to say something different than what we said last time so yeah relatively short episode not much I can You're do back. for that how did it go did you see an evil spirit no I only saw an event staff member pretending to be a ghost uh, wh so that's what's going on here no evil spirits no danger it's all just a setup. Uh, that's all there is to the test of courage. I, I, I see. So I was wrong again. Oh no, uh, sweetie. In that case, I suppose there's no reason for us to linger here any longer. Remember that strange miss we found earlier? I would like to investigate that further. Yes, that was proof of an evil spirit's presence, but we can't be sure if the spirit's still here. Actually, I would also like to investigate that further. We've already come all this way. Let's have a look. You're right. I'll focus my mind and spirit. Good boy. Perhaps it'd be more effective for us to split up. Evil spirits will keep their distance if they sense the power of my pure Yang spirit. So you'll be more likely to find one if you're on your own. Uh, and then I'll wait for you to come and defeat it? Yes, that would be best. Just keep it distracted till I arrive. I'll take this side, you take the other side. Let's move. Okie dokie. Didn't take much to cheer him up. Okay, where am I going? Up here? That, that is a spirit, alright. Okay. Hello? Help you. Um, that exorcist with the blue hair. He's so scary. No, he's not. Um, can you lead him away from here? He makes Paul feel so frightened. Are you being affected by his yang energy? I wouldn't dare get anywhere near him. Um, his energy is so horrible. It'll make me disappear. Isn't that the point? Oh, Uh, he'll have to be the one that decides what to do. I'm not gonna get in the way of his work. Even for a uh, ghost of a little kid, I don't think. Well, I have an idea. Um, I saw the exorcist with blue hair arguing with someone over there a few minutes ago. I'll scare those troublemakers away, but you have to ask the exorcist to let me go, okay? Are you telling the truth? Uh, of course. Shen Shen never lies. So, um, what do you say? He'll be the one that decides, but I'll try and explain the situation best I can. Um, uh, okay. So, I'll take that as a yes. I hope the exorcist with blue hair is a good person. Um, so, I'll help him and... You'll go talk to him. Hopefully then he'll leave me alone. Sound good? Oh boy. Okay. Alright, Chang Yun! Hey, 
They're turning the whole place upside down looking for evil spirits. Other participants are starting to complain. Yeah, why would an exorcist show up at the test of courage and tell everyone that there are no ghosts here? You're just stirring up trouble. Honestly, I find this whole thing quite confusing. If there really are ghosts here, then you're using them to make more of, regardless of the participants' safety. You tell me, is that ethical business practice? Oh boy. If there are no ghosts here, then your so-called test of courage is nothing but a big scam. Not only are you avoiding my questions, but now you accuse me of causing trouble? Oh boy, he's getting worked up. This is what kind of event the test of courage is. It's not our problem that you're taking it so seriously. And now that you're disturbing our participants, we'll have to ask you to leave. If anything about this made any sense at all, I would leave of my own volition. But if I leave now, I'm leaving evil spirits to their own devices. I wonder what I should say in this situation. going on everyone's starting to panic I is there really a ghost now you're getting the hint silly. if everyone starts running someone could get hurt everyone just calm down no need to panic please move in an orderly fashion <laughs> i see so there's no evil spirits here just a wandering ghost and she scared everyone away because i was in trouble she only scared them. She didn't hurt anyone. If things are as you say, then she doesn't seem like a malignant spirit. She's a ghost, but she's also just a kid. Hmm. All right. As long as she promises not to harm anyone, then I'll pretend that I never knew about her. However, if she ever does harm anyone, it'll be my job as an exorcist to come and purge her, to mend my mistake. I don't think that would happen. I hope so. We should go now. It doesn't seem we're particularly welcome here anyway. Mm. What's wrong? I was under the impression you wouldn't be willing to let her go. I have faith in my judgment of good and evil. But if I begin to neglect my perception of good and evil, it may lead to something I regret for the rest of my days. Mm. I didn't expect you to have a gentle side. Wait, you mean... <laughs> you didn't think I could be fair and reasonable? Really? Do I look so obstinate? I know you better now. That's alright. Yeah, you're right. Alright, we should leave now. Let's say goodbye to her. Uh... Okay. Aww. Their own difficulties, considering the circumstances you might need to take the trouble on his behalf. Aww. That was cute. I like that. Okay. Um. Okay. So. We got these two. So next week. We'll probably. We're going to. We're starting at the bottom and working our way up. Um. We're going to go and try to get this branch right here. Um. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you then. Goodbye!